Hi everyone and welcome along to this, the second in a series of videos that I'm creating to hopefully gain more clarity and focus in your business and to help you when we move out of a state of lockdown. The reason that I'm doing these is because things have changed quite significantly recently and for some people those changes aren't so good. Now the whole point with what's changing is that more is going to change. There's more to happen, more to change and we're going to get into a position where things are going to improve. Now the more you can start to look at the focus of what your business is doing and to get the clarity behind it, you can hopefully drive forward even quicker when we move out the other side. So I explained in my first video, my hair is, is short, there's a sort of a slightly medical reason as to why I can't have it too long. It's shorter than I intended, but hopefully it'll get better. I also talked about the vision and traction organizer, um, which is here, VTO for short, which is one of the tools from the entrepreneurial operating system, or EOS for short. This is what I use on a day-to-day -day basis, and all of the tools are available to you, they're free. So if you need a copy of the VTO, then please let me know, and I'll ping a copy across to you. The section we're talking about today in the VTO is the core focus. Now with the core focus, there are two parts to it. And to put simply, or to put them simply, they are the what and the why you do what you do. The first part is the purpose, the cause, or the passion. Now you might find that your business relates more strongly to one of those three, but it could be that it's got a, a relation to a couple of those. But ultimately, what you need to be identifying, and this is the why your business exists. Why does it exist? What is it here for? What's the purpose for it? And again, so purpose is, is that. What are, you do, what are you trying to do? What market are you into? What are you trying to resolve? What problems are you trying to resolve as a part of your business? It could be there's a cause that you're trying to resolve. There could be a certain thing like um, resolving cancer, cancer charities, and the cause there is to try and resolve that. Um, and a passion could be something that is a little pet project maybe, something that you're absolutely mad passionate about doing, um, say going for a racing, a racing driving team. They are absolutely passionate about winning and want to just go and do what they can to win um, a series. The next part of this one is the niche, or as the Americans like to call it, the niche. And that, again, confused me a lot when I heard it the first time. But the niche, this is more about the what. So you've talked about the why, why you exist, and the niche needs to be all around the what. So what is it that you do, what is it you provide, and how do you provide that in a way that is better than anybody else? So with those two things combined, that creates your core focus, which is that section of the VTO completed, and in the next video I'll come on to the marketing strategy.